Hey guys and welcome to our taste test. Today we're going to be trying like loads of different food from around the world. Um, do you want to introduce yourselves? Yeah, so I'm Anna and I've brought some pasta in. I'm Naomi and I've put some salt fish and kalaloo. My name's Denise and I've brought some jerk chicken. I'm Shannon <laughs> and, I brought, <laughs> and I've brought some noodles and there's like some Czech sweets and Welsh cakes and bread and we've got like a Czech drink as well. Right, what should we start with? Some wings, I guess. Right, okay. Let's, let's all just grab <laughs> so oh, 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 let's oh. start. Wait, grab there. Right, ready? Ready? ready. <laughs> Stunning. That's good. Oh my god. <laughs> That's really good. That's so good. How did you make it, Vinny? I literally just marinated it yesterday and then cooked it today for like an hour. Oh my Brilliant. god. That's amazing. I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> Should we try the pasta just because it's here? Yeah. Right, so <clears throat> I feel like we should try and take one of these and just shove it all in our mouth. Is it so hot? Yeah. yeah, I think it will be. <laughs> Don't have a fork. <laughs> <laughs> Where's this from? Italy. How did you cook it? So I made garlic, red pepper, basil, pesto and passata, which is like a tomato sauce. And then a bit of chilli powder. How did you get that in your mouth? I'm very warm. It's not very warm. It's not warm. <laughs> oh. What's your favourite Italian restaurant in Cardiff? <clears throat> um, Giovanni's, because it's like homemade. I feel like I've, ne I've never been there, but it's I really want to go there. And they give you like massive plates. Yeah. Should you try this? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right, tell me about it. Uh, so, it's like a spin on, well they're both dishes, but you can do salt fish and ackee, but I don't like cooking ackee because I'm pretty sure my dad told me it's poisonous. Right. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm like the poisoning people today. So I do kalaloo instead, and I like spinach, it's kind of like the same thing. Okay, and would you just eat this like on its own? Uh, maybe with some ardo bread, it's like a breakfast thing we usually used to have before Christmas. Okay, fair enough. How do you make it? Um, so the fish comes um, preserved in salt, so you have to boil it like five times oh, really? to get rid of it. Yeah, and then um, you just open the can of kalaloo, fry it a little bit, add the fish, and it's pretty good. Yeah. I yeah, feel really like good. we should put some on that bread. Yeah. Mix Ooh, some yeah, cultures. Right. Everyone Where's this bread from? This is Czech bread. Czech bread. Right. Because you would eat it with bread normally, wouldn't you? Yeah. Okay. Right. Let's all see if this puts a spin on it. Cheers! This is also vegan bread, just for I'll let you know. Um, so have a nice bite! Oh, dropped it everywhere. Great. <laughs> no, that tastes nice on the bread. Mm. Mm. It kind yeah, of tastes like good. salmon. I don't want it. Does it? No. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> right. So I feel like we should do like a quick challenge while we're here. Okay. So I think we should give ourselves a minute and see how many crackers we can get in our mouth. <laughs> well, we can eat in a right, minute, right. Yeah? yeah? Do you have to swallow them, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Right. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> one. One. Two. Oh my god, this is dry. Three. Three. Nice though. They are nice, aren't they? They're, kind they're of like corn crackers, but not as much taste. I like they're fine oil. Four. What are you guys on? I'm on four. Five. Four. You're five. <laughs> oh my god, what? <laughs> you don't have water. This is nothing. Six. I really like these. Mm -hmm. 
really boring. I'm on Saturday. No, no, no. No, no, no. Ow! No, no. 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 So, Bernice won. Oh, right. Bernice, considering you won, you can pick what we eat next. Uh, some noodles. Right, so, I mean, these noodles are quite spicy. Oh, that's fine. I love spicy noodles. So, what should we do? Should we do. Should we just try it first, okay. and then I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Oh god! I'm having some troubles. <laughs> right, cheers. <laughs> They're pen. Mm. Oh, those are good. <laughs> They're good. They got kicked on. They're spicy. Yeah. yeah, they are. But it's like a nice oh. spice. What level are you in, Nando's? <laughs> um, I get Perry Table, which isn't actually on the menu. But what is it? It's like barbecue, so you can get Perry Table, which is just like barbecue, and then Perry Flame, which is like spicy barbecue. So, really? Yeah. And you ask at the till? You just ask at the till, yeah. They you get me up at the menu. Get a fino pitta with Perry Tamer. Stunning. Stunning. <laughs> what about you guys? Uh, well, I go from medium. I go for extra hot. Right. Bernice. <laughs> 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 I mean, I'm more of a medium girl, but I have like the extra hot like sauce on the side. Yeah. So, should we try the cake next? Yeah. It's like a cream stuff like pastry cake from Chef. Stunning. So, I'm in. Everyone grab a slice. I want the big one. Right, we'll just have it. <laughs> <laughs> So good. It reminds me of like um custard slice. Like, yeah. <laughs> mm. That's good. I love that. Mm. That is good. That is stunning. <laughs> right. So we're gonna try some cofula. <laughs> <laughs> and it's like Czech cola. And I feel like we should just, you know, get it open. Right. Not too much. Alright. It smells really gingery. Yeah. Ooh. Has it got ginger in it? Ready? Should we right. just, just, uh, just have a little sip? Okay, first initial reaction. <coughs> it tastes like flat coke. Yeah. Mm -hmm. then. Not even that, like. Typically it tastes like Cavorni or cough syrup. I feel like it doesn't really taste like of it. anything. Um. <sighs> Should we do the Welsh cake? Yeah. Does anyone know where like Welsh cakes, like the idea came from? No idea. No <laughs> I mean, to all our followers, let us know. <laughs> Leave it in the comment section below. <laughs> <laughs> oh, have you all tried Welsh cakes? Um, um, yeah, stunning. I love them. I literally don't like raisins. Oh, oh I hate the raisin ones. You yeah. can't really taste oh. them. Oh. Right. Uh, is it okay if I just give them to you? Like, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Don't mind me touching them. <laughs> just pass it down. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> they don't have sugar on. They normally have sugar. No, on. They have like sugar on. Yeah. Yeah. Right. First person to shove it in their mouth. <laughs> Who can fit the whole Welsh cake oh, in their mouth? Absolutely. <laughs> Should we see? Okay. Like try and shove it all in your mouth. Oh my god. <laughs> Obviously, you can make it in your mouth. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> right, and now let's have a bite of our sweaty, oh soggy God. Welsh cake. Not bad. They're not the best Welsh cakes in the world. Oh, well. Nah. Is that? Is that really weird? What is that? <laughs> <laughs> or it's like cutting ice cream. Quite odd. Oh, I don't want it. I feel you like banana to. tastes like. I think it's nice. Great. Just drop chocolate in the noodles. <laughs> yeah. It just smells like those banana sweets. Oh, right. God, yeah, that's so banana. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. <laughs> ah, why is it so sweet and spicy? Ah, food. chocolate. Oh, my. It tastes spongy. I don't know if you don't want to eat it. <laughs> Like when there's banana sweets. 
dragged it out. <laughs> so, if you had to eat one dish for the rest of your life, like literally just the same thing, what would it be? Like, you can't, if you're gonna say Indian, I wanna know a curry. Okay. <laughs> right. Chinese, beef with black bean sauce, fried rice, banging. Banging meal. Good choice. That's good. Yeah, dumplings, either Japanese dumplings, vegetable or Jamaican <coughs> dumplings. What's the difference between all of them? Um, so, Jamaican dumplings is literally just flour and cornmeal, and it just rises, like you fry it, and it's like a little golden ball, basically. So it's more crunchy? <coughs> yeah. Okay, fair. It's really, really good. Fair enough. So if I could eat one food for the rest of my life, I'd eat my nan's pasta, which is in like a red sauce with meat, and the big pasta's like that. Because no one else yeah. makes it as nice as her. Fair. I mean, not to copy you or anything, <laughs> <laughs> but I'd probably eat my nan's curry just because, like, it's like my go-to all the time as well. Like, even when I'm drunk and I'm, I'm like going home. Yeah. Like if I'm at my house and it's in the kitchen, I'm having it. Yeah. It's just so warm and it's like potatoes and peas mm. and it's veg and it's just <laughs> banging. <Lunch. laughs> yeah, nan's food is the best. Okay, so after trying each of his food, what do you think like the importance is of like trying different foods from different cultures? I feel like it's it is really important to like have the opportunity to try everyone's food. Yeah. yeah. Um I feel like it brings us together and like makes everything just a bit more like I don't know, like communal. Communal. <laughs> that is the word I was thinking of. Because otherwise you're just like ignorant to other people. Definitely. Yeah. Um, yeah. I feel like it's good that we all made it ourselves too, rather than, because it's different when you like buy it from a shop or like go to like a restaurant. Yeah. Because it's not always like authentic. Yeah, that's true. You know what I mean? War. War and authentic. <laughs> <laughs> and you too. <laughs> what about you two? I don't know, I feel like it brings my family together, like cooking and everything. Yeah. 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 I feel like, yeah, like with my family, it's sort of like, my mum like learnt from my nan and then like I learnt from my mum like you just watch everyone mm -hmm. cooking and it's like do you guys like cook together at home yeah 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 do you and feel like it's a p important to cook together yeah, yeah like yeah. in my house like if we're having dinner like we have to sit at the table and we all sit at the table and eat together like you're not allowed to go like sit in the living room and eat it's like really? it's like a, cool. like eating dinner is like a thing you know I feel like it's not really like that in my house. It's Maybe it's just because like everyone's got like a busy lifestyle yeah. and they all work at different times. Yeah, or if they could. But if we're all at home at the same time, then like we all sit yeah. Table. yeah. Fair enough. Thanks for joining <laughs> us today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I, did, yeah. I feel yeah. like let's just quickly say what your favourite food is. On the table? Yeah. Okay. Um out of everything, even the sweets. The cake, which is no longer here, but <laughs> <laughs> the cream cake is so nice. Yeah, I liked the wings. Wings, yeah. Um, I liked the pasta. Oh, <laughs> um, I feel like the fish like surprised me because I don't really eat yeah. fish, so I feel like the fish for me. But I mean, thanks and uh, see you guys later. <laughs> Bye. Bye.